For more stock news updates on the best stocks to buy, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and now let's get right into it. NVIDIA's graphics processing units, also known as GPUs, are renowned in the industry for accelerating intricate data center tasks, particularly in artificial intelligence applications. NVIDIA has solidified its dominant position and improved its capacity to profit from AI by expanding into various product categories. Its range includes related hardware such as central processing units and networking devices devices, as well as subscription-based software and cloud services that aid in AI application development. According to Toshiya Hari from Goldman Sachs, this is a crucial differentiator. He stated in a note to clients, We believe NVIDIA will continue to be the industry standard for the foreseeable future, given its competitive edge that covers both hardware and software capabilities. NVIDIA's yearly release of new products and platforms drives an innovation pace that keeps it at the industry's forefront. Wall Street anticipates NVIDIA will increase its non-generally accepted accounting principles earnings per share by 38% annually through 2027, ending in January 2027. This consensus estimate makes its current valuation of 66.7 times adjusted earnings appear acceptable. Investors might find it prudent to acquire a small stake in this semiconductor company today. Broadcom offers a wide range of information technology solutions, but it is primarily recognized for its dominance in data center networking chips for switches and routers and application-specific integrated circuits. Switches and routers facilitate the movement of information between data center servers and other networks, and their effectiveness relies on semiconductor throughput. Given the vast data quantities involved, rapid chips are crucial for AI applications, and Broadcom offers the fastest chips available. JP Morgan Chase forecasts that spending on data center networks working chips will increase by 20 to 30 percent annually over the next few years. For example, Broadcom assists Alphabet's Google and Meta platforms in developing AI chips and recently announced a third unnamed customer speculated by analysts to be Amazon, Apple, or ByteDance. Currently, ASICs represent less than 10% of AI chips, but UBS predicts the market will surpass GPU sales in the upcoming years, with ASICs comprising 30% of AI chips by 2027. Wall Street expects Broadcom to grow its non-generally accepted accounting principles earnings per share by 21% annually, concluding in October 2027. This projection makes its current valuation of 36.7 times adjusted earnings seem quite reasonable. Long-term investors might find it wise to purchase some shares of Broadcom stock today. Supermicrocomputer specializes in creating high-performance computing platforms for data centers. Its portfolio includes servers and storage systems tailored for analytics and AI, along with server management software and server subsystems like motherboards and power supplies that can be assembled into complete solutions. Supermicro is a leader in AI servers, with its market share increasing due to its in-house manufacturing capabilities and modular product design approach. This allows the company to rapidly produce a variety of servers equipped with the latest chips using common components, with most assembly taking place internally in Silicon Valley. This enables swift prototyping and product launches. Supermicro can usually introduce new technologies to the market before its competitors, often two to six months earlier. Hans Mosesman from Rosenblatt Securities recently emphasized this advantage, stating, Supermicro has developed a model that is very quick to market. They typically have the broadest product portfolio when a new product is launched by NVIDIA Advanced Micro Devices or Intel. Supermicro accounted for 10% of AI server sales in 2023, but analysts at Bank of America predict that figure will rise to 17% by 2026. Tom Blakely from KeyBank is even more optimistic, projecting that Supermicro could achieve a 23% market share in AI servers by 2025. These forecasts are promising for shareholders, as JP Morgan Chase predicts the AI server market will expand by 460% between 2023 and 2027. Wall Street expects Supermicro's non-generally accepted accounting principles earnings per share to grow by 41% annually ending in June 2026. This consensus estimate makes its current valuation of 42.3 times adjusted earnings seem reasonable. However, investors should monitor competitors like Dell Technologies and Hewlett Packard Enterprise to ensure Supermicro maintains its market share. Nevertheless, I believe Supermicro shareholders will experience market-beating returns over the next three years.
In the end, NVIDIA's GPUs are essential for AI applications, maintaining a leadership position by diversifying into CPUs, networking equipment, and AI-supportive software and services. Wall Street projects a significant growth of 38% annually in non-generally accepted accounting principles earnings per share through 2027, suggesting its current valuation is reasonable. Broadcom excels in data center networking chips and ASICs, controlling substantial market shares and benefiting from the growing AI demand. With expected annual earnings growth of 21% through 2027, its current valuation appears justified. Supermicrocomputer leads in AI server production, leveraging quick-to-market strategies and in-house manufacturing. Predicted to increase its market share significantly through 2026 makes it a promising investment despite potential competition. For more stock news updates on the best stocks to buy, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video.